How are you? Phil on touching. Today I'm playing Mortis de la Moon from Sebastian Braunert and you Geikin. Oh, and Andy Green too. And that's how I am, isn't it? Music by Pedro Pimenta, who's doing an REM tune on the spec. Is that a button moon rock in the background? I think that's the button moon rock in the background. Andy Green, let me know. Uh, we play Mortis, and as we fell asleep, uh, we heard the Man in the Moon song, and we had a big dinner, and we we assumed it was Dog in the Moon. I think that was the story. Assumed it was. If you saw my video the other day, I got the cassette of this. So now I'm playing it. Now I'm playing it. Uh, you can download this for free, by the way. You don't have to hang around and get the cassette. There's a link in the description below if you want to go and play it. Uh, so we played Mortis. It's a, it's a flipping vertical scrolling shoot em up. As you can know, I guess. Knackers. As ever with shoot em ups, I'm doing absolute pants. I do like the little yapping noise when you press fire. Uh, it's vertical, vertical scrolling shoot em up. Uh, to which we are trying to get to the moon. Uh, I dodged it then, didn't I? See how far I can get. No doubt I will do pants. I will not show this game off to its full uh, full glory. But you know, there's no point in shirking from duties. I've got slammed at me by a TIE Fighter. No, it's not technically a TIE Fighter. If Mr. Lucas is watching. Or Disney. Our overlords. So, we've got to get to the moon. And I don't know what will happen when we do. Will we wake up? Who knows? We'll come out of our dream state and realise we've been eating a big wheel of cheese. But, uh, oh, it's a black hole. When I played, uh, what was it with the play of play? Mortis Strikes Back. Knackers. Dead. Game over. Let's go back in. What did I play the other day? Mortis Strikes Back when I was in the Sinclair C5. I did absolute pants on easy mode. But when he knocked it up to hard, I did amazing. So I might have never gone easy and knock it up to hard. I can fly straight through that. Look at that. I thought there was be thought because there were caution signs. I couldn't touch it, but I can, obviously can. Uh, if I don't do well on this next go onto easy, then I'll go on hard and see if I do better. But we'll give it a go. But it's good. I do like uh, what Andy's done with the uh, graphics on the side. A nice big surround of Mortis on the side there. <laughs> it's it's now getting a bit hectic. There's Mortis' tag. So he's, he's in a dream state now. We have to remember that. It's in a dream state when I'm looking at... Uh, is that a hot dog sausage? There's a TARDIS. And there's E.T. Has E.T. got hypodermic needle? Is that his frightening finger? Some weird stuff floating around here. Some weird stuff floating around here. Is that the Pink Floyd prism? I think it is. Take it in the background and I should be shooting shit up. Is that the, I think I've just shot the Silver Surfer. Knackers. Who's going to defend us against Galacticus now? I'm all over it now. I'm all over it. I'm doing it. I know I shouldn't have said that because I'm going to die, but I'm doing it. There's some rabbit poo. Oh, Flip, what's that? They're frightening. Look at those monsters. Can I touch them? I don't. Yep, I can touch them. I thought they were going to be baddies. But it's just decoration. I am doing it. I might actually get past that. I wonder, well, I've got nearly said it. Nearly said I might get past level one. But uh, there might be, I wonder if it will like, like Kronos did when they went to fuel and they got slammed by the International Space Station. I wonder if it's going to phase like Kronos does into like level 2. Or we're going to get an end of level buddy. But hopefully it phases into level 2. Can't deal with end of level that. Oh, it's the big moon! Oh, the moon. Ow! Oh, I got killed by the moon. It's the moon from the mighty boosh. Oh, I'm the moon. Is it going to put me back at the moon? Please let it. I don't want to go through. I've got to go through the entire level again. <laughs> you absolute sod. 
Well, at least we know we can do it. At least I know I achieved. So let's get back to the moon and shoot the fuffer out the sky. Hang on. Four more to have to get to the moon. We're just trying to shoot it up. Perhaps that's not the moon we wanted to get to. As I said, I got this on cassette. But if you want to play it now, there's a link to at the bottom. You can go and download it for free. And you can play it to your heart's content. <laughs> Plenty of pew pews going on. Well, Yelp yelps. Because it does sound like uh, more is, is yelping up quite a bit. As ET with his either scary finger or scary hypodermic needle. International Space Station. TIE Fighters. Not sure what those ships are. Silver Surfer. Giant Orange. A bit like, uh, What were those? Oh, Christ! Oh, TIE Fighters. Dead. What were those ships out of? Those baddies out of? Thinking Tron. Or am I thinking Black Hole? Can't remember. Don't know what those are. Oh, the, the, these, those remind me of Nell from like that cowboy space film. And the guy of the Waltons in it. John Boy. <sighs> Knackers. Come on, we know we can get to the moon. We've got to get back there. We've got to get past level one. Show me down great. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, doggy. Shoot those comics and that orange. There's Mortis's collar. That's it. Get back to the moon. Destroy the moon. Like Moon Base Alpha, Space 1999. And then we can get to level two. People can declare me as a king, and then everybody can die happy. That's a total swarm of TIE fighters going on there. Silver Surfer, International Space Station, the ship from that, like, what was that film called? It had John Boy in it. I'm sure the spaceship, he called it Nell. I think uh, Hannibal Smith was in it from the A-Team as well. Gregory Peck. was his name? Gregory Peck. I think it was. That's it. We're nearly at the moon. That's the TARDIS. Come on, come on. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Knackers! Right, let's go for hard mode. Because we did a lot better in hard mode. Oh my. Mortis strikes back. Let's romp it. Let's romp it. Stars seem to be moving faster in the background. They're moving faster, I'll tell you that. Stars seem to be moving faster, so perhaps hard mode is everything goes that little bit faster. Yep, everything's going a little bit faster. <laughs> See if I can keep up. Can I keep up? Can I flip? No. No. I can't press fire quick enough. I guess if you have a joystick, you can cheat and put auto fire on. I ain't got no joystick. I'm keyboard only. Keyboard only. No joystick here. Destroy the comets. Get down. Shoot orange. Weird ships that I think are from like Tron or Black Hole. Go on, go on. Dodged it. That was some mad skills going on there. I'd like to get to the moon on this level. See if we can get this, uh, destroy it. Sounds a bit weird that I want to destroy the moon. Flipping heck. Flipping heck. Mm. I didn't think I was going to make that then. Oh, no, 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 no. Too slow. I'm too old and I'm too slow. I won't do more. It's a good service here. <laughs> That's just flew into the flight path of the bad bastards. Right. Not this time, mate. Game face on. That's 
Ah, no, no one. That was Moist to the Moon from Sebastian Brodet, Hugh uh, Geiking, and Andy Green, and excellent music again from Pedro Pimenta. Bow off! TTF Henry, oh, additional graphics are all from Carl McNeil. TTF Henry, ta ta for now, cheerio, and bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. I oh, enjoyed that a lot. I'm absolute crap now. Absolute pants. Better expect to be. Thank you.